Good morning and in what's becoming a familiar story we see the Australian dollar test new highs again on Friday touching 81.36 and opening again reasonably stronger this week trading around that 81 cent handle. The question is now can we continu continue to sustain these levels moving forward? This week proves to be a busy one with a number of key headline items plaguing the macroeconomic docket. We look first to our own local inflation numbers on Wednesday and President Trump's State of the Union address rolling into the Federal Reserve's monetary policy statement and Friday's non-farm payroll numbers as well. There has been a continued run of US dollar weakness following comments last week from the Treasury Secretary. Uh, pushing the, I guess, the America First policy that Trump administration has highlighted throughout its presidency so far and, and suggesting that protectionist trade policies will be a thing that continue to govern that to, Republican government moving forward throughout this term and put a suggestion that perhaps that will weigh on the US dollar moving forward. That helped to push the euro and the pound to fresh highs as well. But now we focus on whether the Australian dollar can extend up towards the levels around 82 US cents. With Treasury yields in the US touching 2.68% on Monday, we do suggest the short-term correction for the Australian dollar is due. Those Treasury yields are now uh, pushing beyond our own and with the FOMC expected to push interest rates above our RBA domestic interest rates before the end of the year and commodity prices expected to moderate, then a pullback below these levels and a short to medium term correction back to the points that we saw at around December at 76, 75 could perhaps be on the cards through the coming months ahead.